thank Hiya. you so so much for coming um it's amazing to see everyone so it is sunday the 15th of september and we are in south shields now a week ago this was the finish of course to the great north run and that is the reason we're here today of course uh, in memory of the young lad sam williams who unfortunately died during the race last week and today uh, there's a little sort of memorial run in his memory and um, that's what we're going to do today so it's called run for sam and that's what we're doing running for sam This uh, run today has been organised by um, Stephanie Cochran. She's worked hard over the last week. And um, there's actually two different runs happening. Uh, one is starting from the 11 mile point of the Great North Run, which was the um, place where Sam collapsed. And there's another run from the Shooter Lighthouse. And it's all finishing at the finish area for the Great North Run opposite of Bambra and both runs are 2.1 miles because that was how far away from the finish Sam was and finishing the race for him is basically what it's about. Um, the theme is blue, he was raising money for mines um, in memory of his sister and um, that particular charity is a lot of money has been raised obviously on the back of this. There is going to be a link in the description to the video for that if you do want to donate to mines and there is another uh, GoFundMe page as well, set up for Sam's daughter as well. So um, I'll put a link to that at the bottom as well. So please, if you can, give to that as well. A great cause, of course. Look at that big rock. Wow. Now, obviously, this is the kind of cut-off point, really. You've got the 11 mile markers up there, up that way. And the suit of lighthouse is this way. And they're the two places where the run is supposed to be starting so it's just a choice really of where we want to go I'm thinking lighthouse so there it is super lighthouse which I believe was the first electric lighthouse in the country maybe even be the world I'm not sure but anyway it's very nice isn't it Look at that, incredible. And there'll probably be just as many at the 11 mile point as well. Hi, I just see Thank you so, so much for coming. Um, it's amazing to see everyone here today. Um, Thank you so much. If anyone wants to come and grab a, um, one of these to stick on your t-shirt, and then anyone who wants to start walking, um, to, to start walking just ASAP and then any runners to follow. But thank you so, so much. Um, and let's keep pushing to raise money for Sam's daughter. Um, and yeah, Sam, I hope we do you proud today. Thank you, everyone. Well, that was actually uh, really emotional, wasn't it? Um, Stephanie there. Um, welcoming everybody here, so many people, and there's still going to be some at the 11 mile um, marker as well. So, what a turnout! Brilliant. <laughs> so, it looks as though the majority of people are setting off now. It's going to be quite an interesting route along the coastal path. Let's see it below.
Hi everyone. <coughs> We've all come here today for the same purpose, which is to pay honour, tribute and love to the incredible Sam Whelans. We send an abundance of love and support to his family and friends, which has been shown this week by each and every one of you, whether that is on social media or by being here today. 60,000 people participated in the Great North Run, Sam being one of them, and the fact that he lost his life while participating has devastated the whole community and the nation, and most of all, his beloved family who have lost him so suddenly. As we set out to do this, in memory of him and his sister Carly and his friend Matty. The devastation that his stories caused to the wider, wider community and all over the country, and the reason why that Sam was doing the run has touched the hearts of every single person. And I speak for everyone when I say, our deepest condolences go to Sam's family, friends, and anyone close to him that's been affected. Now, if a few people could come forward um, and we're going to let some balloons off. As you can understand, it's really, really difficult for Sam's family to speak at this time. So I'm here with his mum. I'm speaking on her behalf. She would just like to thank everyone for all of their support, for turning up today, for all the kind messages um, and support over the past week in the tragic events um, of losing their beloved son. Sam was such an amazing person inside and out. And that really shows today with everyone that's come to support them. So. On behalf of Sam's family, his parents, thank you very, very much. Can everyone please stand and join me for a two minute silence? Um, Rachel and Omar from the new sundial have really kindly put some food and refreshments on um, and opened the function room up for everyone, um, anyone who wants to come and join me to raise a glass for Sam. Thank you so much everyone. To be here today has just been incredible. Um, to see the support um, just, yeah, you, you can't really um, put it into words. It's just, uh, it is just uh, so emotional is probably the, the best word for it. I mean, brilliant um, from uh, Stephanie there for the work that she put in to get this organised. Just incredible. Um, the number of people that were here today, the sea of blue everywhere, just, wow. Um, you know, I've done quite a lot of running events, but... This was something just, well, you can't, I can't even describe what that was like. It was just amazing. Um, so, yeah, I say there will be links in the in the video to, um, to the GoFundMe pages for, uh, obviously, Sam's daughter and, and for mine as well. So if you do want to contribute anything to that, please um, do so. We really much appreciate it. And, yeah, um, the balloons and that wow I mean Christ I'm just uh, yeah it's just amazing really so yeah um, well done for everyone for coming today turning up making the event what it was really and yeah um, well we'll see you soon guys <laughs>